Um, let's make sure that things right. So I can what I'm doing. Uh, I'm um, just I might as well have it in background so that when people if people wondering it's not just a completely black screen I need to sort that out Okay. It is off. going to have to sort out that audio. Anyone who's wandering in, I'm sure this is riveting seeing me just post all the places. Unfortunately, I... yeah. Unfortunately, I've got the problem of um, Wonder Song doesn't, uh, for whatever reason, it can only work being shared. Also, hi, Beerbit. Um, or Brewbit. How is your name meant? How is your screen name meant to be pronounced? I'm never quite sure. Because I've heard Spork pronounce it one particular way and it's always been a bit of a confusing moment for me. <laughs>
Ah, Burbit. Uh, ah, that's it. As you can see, I'm on a few, um... <laughs> I'm using OBS. Um, yeah, weirdly, it's just for whatever reason, it's deciding. Um, and I am admittedly very new at it all. Uh, uh, um, actually, yeah, I. that chop that over to there yeah and if nothing else it'll mean that people aren't seeing all my uh, <laughs> discord channels Last time I did any sort of streaming was years ago, so I'm... <laughs> uh, it's just a case of, I, I'm sort of like, oh, I, I'm enjoying this channel, let's join the ch Discord. Um, and then I, <laughs> I'm rarely interacting with them, it's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> I feel very awkward on cameras. It's sort of like. Ah, hello, pieces. Uh, just doing the whole. You're probably going to be hearing the music for a bit. Uh, I think what will probably, probably end up happening in my case is. I'll ha I'll ask one of my friends to set up a Discord, something like that. And um, I'll just be sort of like, yeah, I'm just the person who is the face of the company. It's the other person. <laughs> the the main wit. The main weird thing for me is I'm more I'm more used to doing things on camera when it's recording me as opposed to doing things live. So it's, it's very it, it's a very different um, it's, a, it's a very different sort of I suppose dynamic. It, I don't know. 
Um, I, I've, I've actually, because I've sort of jury rigged the monitor that would normally be used for a PC. I suppose that's a good way of thinking about it. Um, but yeah, it's sort of jury rigging a PC monitor to be my second monitor for my laptop. <laughs> uh... Yeah. And of course, hello Sporks channel. Just the first 12 minutes of the stream has been me going through the various channels I'm on and just sort of like, yeah, I'm doing this. Come along if you feel so inclined. Thanks for the follows! <laughs> and... Uh... And uh... I promise I'll eventually get to the end of the list. <laughs> no worries, I mean... It... I... I'm kind of springing this on you all it very um haphazardly here <laughs> got an update from one of the servers. Um, it's all movie night thing. saying about not picking your nose and now I've got a major itch right in this all the times That out of the way. One thing I'm questioning is if it's actually updated. 
accurately updated the thing. Because for some reason... Yep. Yep, that is updated. Because for some reason, when I did my test, it was weirdly saying that I was streaming Metal Gear Solid 5, and I'm sort of like, that's not what I'm streaming. Why are you showing that? Anyway, let's underway. Ah, okay. Okay, why is it showing? Let's there get some night. There we go. <laughs> Uh, well, the funny thing is, ages ago when I was going to try doing streaming um, a while back, I did have the intention of um, streaming Metal Gear Rising, Metal Gear Solid even. I've been playing Metal Gear Rising recently, that's why I was thinking of that. <laughs> right, why has it changed that? There. And why have you changed the resolution back down? A crowd of spirits took over the town. Everyone's freaking out. It's pretty funny. Well, see you around. Okay. Why have you decided to... Okie dokie, thanks for the luck. So, if you're unfamiliar with the game, the whole setup is... Um, you've, by pure accident, been selected to try and help save the world from being completely Noah's Ark. Um, the justification, instead of it being the wickedness of man or anything like that, the creator gets bored. And basically you've got to find the Song of Creation or something like that, and save the world from being destroyed and basically give the creator a reason not to destroy the world uh from the from my understanding the creator is a fickle and capricious mistress who will just wipe the slate clean on a whim And yeah, so the whole mechanic, and it keeps changing the resolution. I do not understand why it is doing that. <laughs> Quite possibly. I always get the feeling that um, the Sims are not entirely happy with their lots in life. What's with the res- I, I am very confused with why this is going to- If this is going to be a recurring- I, I'm possibly going to have to have a look into why that's a problem. Hi. Are you from around here? Yeah. You know the Overseer's song. Oh, useless. I swear to you, this whole town, a few ghosts and everyone's useless. I don't have to um, to talk to you. The world is ending. Uh. So she's Miriam. And for some reason, I gave her an old crone voice. I don't know why. Um, OK, I need to know, why do you keep changing the resolution? Um, it 
it clearly can do 1920 by 1080, so I don't know why it keeps... Tree village this way. This way to Tree of Slumber. Uh, right. So I played a little bit of this a while ago and I saw some of the ending on a stream. That's how I. Well. It was in my library for ages, but I didn't. But I didn't realise <laughs> it had been until watching it on stream. And yeah, I was just intrigued by it. E oh my! What's going on? In my home, right there. There's a real life bona fide ghost. Well, it can't be real life because it's a ghost, so by its very definition, it's dead. What? I kind of want to see. Don't be a hero! Who are you gonna call? Someone else. Uh, that's a little bit of uh, Casper's rest. Casper's first movie reference. Uh, I wish I could remember enough of the other move, mo the direct-to-video movie, or was it direct-to-TV? It was direct-to-something. I watched it to death back in the day, but uh, oh, I go, she still hasn't come out. <laughs> Actually, no, this isn't the right voice for him. I'm, I know what voice. I, I, believe, I believe you have my stapler. It's the end of Lang Tree as we know it. I, I, I'm going to burn down the whole house with the, the ghost in it. <laughs> um. <laughs> so apparently, the woman from the Tom and Jerry cartoons is in this. <laughs> Ghost Thomas? Think you can mess with my town? Okay, so... Okay. One of the things that mainly drew me to this game is the whole singing mechanic because it, I'm always down for something that changes things up and obviously with the whole uh, music geekery thing music is very integral to me and well, games that utilize it in more than just a sort of um, Guitar Hero style way, intriguing to me. And especially for later bits, which involve a lot of platforming kind of things. Um, who knows, we might get there. Uh, it depends. Anyway, guess your singing actually did something for once. And apparently she's gone Irish, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you're a good kiddo. But we're still up to our necks in ghosts today, so stay out of trouble. What does Clyde have to stay? It's the bend is fantastic. I hope he's safe again. When the mayor went in there, I, I have to admit I was worried. I thought I might have to burn down the entire house. 
Of course, it was no problem for her. Yeah, because I totally didn't do anything. Thanks, Clyde. Wing. Let's see what's going on in this house. Hello, little bird. I've been hiding here from all the ghosts. If I wait long enough, mayhaps they'll go away. What are you doing? What a little hero! Do be careful, little bird. Saving the town is what mayors are for. Um. <laughs> <laughs> so she's clearly not a Londoner. Um, well, she's clearly not a Londoner from back about ten years ago, at least. Oof. There are a lot of ghosts that way. Okie dokie, thanks for the luck. You take care of yourself and take care of Panda, as I know she's rather poorly. If it isn't the bardling. Watch yourself today. The ghosts around town are qu proving quite a problem. I tried scaring off the one in our house with my axe, but it wasn't very afraid of axes. Hopefully the mayor can sort it out soon. So apparently everyone in this town is... I'm just going to give everyone an Irish accent. That's... That's how we're proceeding. I'm sorry, I don't speak wingdings. I can chop tr down trees, but ghosts are beyond me. Maybe it's as Mary used to tell me. Instead of only training my muscles, I should train my heart. Just kidding. Being strong is great. I miss her. So is she dead or did she run away? That's a question. Um, I. Bartlett! Oh goodness! A dark spirit appeared in Ruby's house. I tried to get her out, but, well, you know how stubborn she can be. She's such a sweet, sweet old girl. If something happened to her, I... Okay, Francine, we'll get her out of there. Oh God, I'm sticking with the... God! It's like Yoda in a green dress. Do you need help? No! Leave me be!
have jars we can put them in? that spirit away yep good thing it's out of your hair huh no it wasn't bothering me you just run and singing into everyone's home uh, <laughs> a very good point it's, it's, it's a very peculiar thing to go about doing uh well Thanks for coming into my home and making a racket. You can leave now. Look around towns that you sang away all those uh, wrong emphasis there. Look around towns that you sang away all the ghosts. And here I thought bards weren't worth a thing. Ah, yeah. I got a favor to ask you. I've got time to perform more miracles. Langtree's got a spirit protector called the Overseer. It could tell us what's what, what with the ghosts here. To visit him, you just gotta learn his song. You know his song? Well, yeah. Can you sing it to me? That wasn't what I had in mind. I ain't a great singer. Yeah, I really ain't so sure about that. Just do your best. All right, get ready to sing along with me. Oh Christ. <laughs> yeah, that ain't gonna work. That's okay. But is there anyone who could sing the song for me? Yeah, one other. I have a singer too. <gasps> oh, Ruby. Grumpy old lady. Yep. And she's the only other one who knows it. Darn Tootin! Ruby acts rough, but I swear she's got a kind old heart in there. Just ask nicely. Hi, Ruby! Uh, Want to learn the song of the Overseer? You know anything about that? And I've ha about had it with you coming into my house with your demands. Ruby! I want that kind of attitude just ain't right. You really don't remember the Overseer song? No. Really? That song you sang all the time? You know, back in the day with Ron, that the gatherings around the old, big old tree, the song that was your job to sing for that every year. You really don't remember that one? Uh, oh yes, that song. I may remember it. Can you sing it? I'll only do it once.
that's how it goes. Thank you, Ruby. And you re weren't really that huge a jerk. Uh, I sang the song for you. You can all get out now. Always a pleasure, Ruby. You don't meet me in town. When I was a little girl, Ruby would sing at the Tree of Slumber. It was supposedly a ritual to commune with the Overseer. But he never did speak to us. was um, different. <laughs> and I still can't speak wingdings. You know, you know the way to the Tree of Slumber? It's out the left of town and up that hall. Imagine how freak, how much that would freak you out to just have someone sing no if you ask them a question. It's out the left of town and up that hill. Sing the song to the tree, to the tree. I'll stay here and make sure my folks are safe. What good am I? I am without singing, I don't know, but... And why does it... Maybe if that... Okay. Let's see if that... Stops it from changing resolution constantly. Yes, there we go. Ah, yeah. something that I'm definitely going to switch off. Flashing effects! Because I know a fair few of my... A fair few people... Well, I'd rather not have cause them to be swallowing their own tongue because of it.
you go. But this is a bit of a curious character. I I don't know much about them. Welcome to the spirit world. I remember you. What are you doing here? I delivered my message, so just drifting around your world, vicariously feeling Aya's unconditional love for all existence, stuff like that. So, you're real? Uh, yeah. Pretty much, yeah. And the world is ending. Yeah. So, how do we stop it? Stop what? How do we stop the world from ending? Well, the one thing that could stop it would be if, ever, if someone sang the Earth song. So we've got to find Michael Jackson. Okay. That's it. I can do that. How does it go? Oh man, it's like so not that easy. The Earth song has no melody. It carries the combined will of all life on this planet. It's a whole thing. Well, how do I learn it? Talk to you, to the overseer here. Big castle. Can't miss it. Like a quest? Oh, yes. Good luck, little bard. Sorry. Um. Okay. Oh yes, I remember. Enough messing around there. No need. The change in coloured sticks. in a World War One trench. As I say, I played a little bit of this a while back. But there's a few things that I'll... And there's a few things I'll remember here and there, but it's very much... Uh, most of it is new on, new to me. Oh, 
snake. Okay, I'm stumped here. It feels like I should be able to get up there by doing that, but I can't. Um, 
You're not giving me much game. seem to be really viable to jump and sing so I'm not sure what <laughs> I, I get right to the edge but I just can't get over that This is the moment where I cave and just decide to look up a walk through. I think it might be. Um, I could remember where I put my phone that is. God, it does that. <laughs> because I can't th I feel like I'm just hitting my head against a brick wall Tablet to wake up. Thank you. 
Seven hours later. Maybe about three hours after my stream should have ended. So correct. Off. I don't want to join your newsletter. Spork, how you doing? Uh, I'm, I am admittedly in a state of I have no idea what to do, so I'm looking up a walkthrough. Uh, um, That's fair enough. I, I'm kind of in this weird state of I played a little bit of the start of it, and which is especially frustrating because I know I've gotten past this bit. So it's one of those, uh, why can't I, why can't I think of how I got past this? Thanks. I I should be able to find what I'm looking for soon enough. Yeah, and thanks for the follow. Always appreciated. Yeah. 
Okay, so it just... It's a very awkward jump to make, that's the problem. Do, 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 do. I've just got to really be right at the edge. I know I can I can do it. It's just because the frustrating thing is I know I've gotten past this point because <laughs> um, I've got I've got at least a couple of achievements from this, and one of them is for beating a boss that is after this point. So whatever it is. Oh. Maybe if I make friends with it like Sisyphus in Hades. And this is where we tense up because... Yeah. <laughs> it's not even needing a run up that's that's what's really throwing me because you know you, you used to platformers needing run ups to do these sorts of jumps and it's more that you need to get right at the top before you move so you've got the full momentum to carry you forward <sighs> pixels pixels different It's not even a double jump going on, so... Um... Let's see... Uh, I can't do... 
Nope, that won't. That doesn't do anything. Unfortunately, that, um, that those roots or whatever they're meant to be, there's that's just background, so I can't use that as a. Basically, like, the bird is your double jump, but not really. Uh, I've got to do that again because... <laughs> This is where I start making strange noises because of frustration. through is not useful in the slightest. Is all it does is confirm for me what I th thought I needed to do. Even if I could just, you know, grab onto the ledge or something. I mean, he's got arms, so it's not like he can't. Hell, Raymond's just got hands. He can still grab onto the ledge. that I can get up there. How's it going? Uh, you are... You have just come into me hitting my head against a brick wall as I try to get past this one section um, which I've been stuck at for a while. I, like, I know what I need to do, it's just getting the timing right. Otherwise, that happens. And I don't think it's going well with me trying to do a running start. That seems to actually be 
doing the opposite of what it normally does in platformers. actually be inclined to to agree there cuz I, I can't think of anything I'm actually doing wrong here Because even just getting up that first ledge is a bit of an awkward jump. actually half the time doing the singing to get the bird just to stop it I'm just going to see if there's a better walkthrough for this. Changing which buttons I was pressing did nothing to help me there. Okay, I seem to... I have a bit more control with the directional arrows instead of WASD. Trying to do the directional arrows for both jumping. Yeah, that was a. 
Ja, wat voor. Af. Wat de flaming. Oké. Okay. Thanks for the words of encouragement. I'm just. Somehow, is this going to if I have to use a controller for this? I'm not going to be happy. Okay, I hmm. I have to wonder if trying to jump from the middle is where you meant... Let's... Test something. What? So I'm going to test, because I do have controller somewhere. Ah, there we go. I'm going to see if it works better with a con if I can do it with a controller. Wind it. All the unraveling. Um. Okay. What? Plug that, but I will right. 
Okay. Let's... Just out of sheer curiosity. Okay, that is... So this tells me one important thing. Controller is good for jumping. Mouse is good for the singing. I almost had it there. I almost had it. God damn, my nose is not going to stop itching, it seems. See, I'm managing that jump much easier, the controller, so that must mean that was going to end up being my Sisyphus. The Sisyphean task. Gets on with this venture. See, those bits I find really fun. <laughs> My vision is impaired, I cannot see. Yeah. 
leap of faith. Seriously? That is, um... Oops. That was on me. I'm going to fully cop to that. Blah. Feels like now that I've gotten past that one really annoying bit, the rest is going to be much smoother. of the mustard gas. <laughs> and we end up in the palaces of Undertale? dealing with <laughs> the cat fairies. Thank oh. gosh. Please tell me you're the overseer. The overseer meow is not. I guess that's okay too. Well, is the overseer around? I came a really long way to see them. 
my master, the Dream King, is... Yeah, we get a lot of those. Is taking a nap. He can't see until he's awake. I don't know why I'm pro I should probably do a different voice. Oh, uh, okay. How long are his naps usually? Usually a few years. But I gotta wait a few years. We all said usually. This last nap has been going on for centuries. I don't have centuries. Please, can you wake him up? I'm on a very important quest. Hmm. Meow understands, but Mr. Dream King does not like to be awoken. You've got to be getting me. I hate that I knew that pun was coming. Ugh. I can do it if you're too scared to. I'm kind of getting shades of when Stalin um, had his heart attack and none of his generals wanted to go check on him because they were all too terrified. I can sing real loud. That's like my thing. That is not going to work. The only the bell atop the castle could do it. I should not have told you that. Oh, well, this talk of napping and getting sleepy. Do not ring that bell. I'm totally gonna do it. Ah, no! Don't do this! How are you gonna stop me? This isn't going to stop me, it's just mildly aggravating. <sighs> Haven't you had enough yet? Oh god, switching voices. No, I don't see what the big deal is. This is like his job, right? I'll learn the song and then he can go back to sleep. We all can see there's no stopping you. But if you bring that determination with you, Mr. Dream King is sure to help you out. Oh, he's filled with determination. Meow be. Oh, they're already halting it with these puns. <sighs> Kind of reminded me of C Coco here.
realized it used two struct logic. Don't speak windings. What? What? Understand me now? Yes. Fantastic. So, why am I awake? Uh, world is ending. Oh. Yeah, and so I adventured into the spirit world and solved a bunch of puzzles and fought with a cat butterfly. So I could come meet you. I want you to teach me the Earth song. Oh. Hey. Sorry about that. Being awake is not my thing. That's okay. Are you really going to teach me the Earth Song? No. The Earth Song channels the voice of all life on this planet. And you are all that life isn't in perfect harmony. The song won't work. So, I'm kinda not seeing the point. Uh, so you won't help? Mm -hmm. It's very... They very clearly the o the creators of this game are cat owners. But what about all the people on the earth? Yeah. What about the rest of the universe? It's all going away. That's the natural order of things. You're asking me to end. Just to save this tiny little piece. A bit selfish, don't you think? I'm not really feeling up to it anyway. Okay, back to sleep now. No, wait. Oh, very sorry. <laughs> There's ghosts haunting Langtree. Oh, that sounds tough. Well, good luck with that. I can't believe that guy. Sorry, little bird. No, that's not the voice I had for her. Did I really g just give up? No. Well, I mean, you could. But I believe in you, little bard. I kind of didn't before. Now, seeing your determination, I do I think you can actually sing the Earth Song. That's the problem with... That's where the accent is coming from, is all the occasional um, dropping of letters. But how? If the Overseer won't help me... There, there's six more, and each one's got a piece. So maybe, screw this guy, let's find the others. Where? Shrug. One thing at a time, you know? First, you gotta deal with those ghosties back home. Okay, I'm out. 
Exit tree to your left. East. Let's see if there's anything... Okay, that's just in the fog again. if that affects these flowers. It does! Air almighty! These things just don't quit. You can do it, my Miss Mare! Thanks, Kai. Oh, that was Clyde. You can do it, Miss Me. Hello. Oh, jeez, it's this, that kid again. <sighs> hey, wait. What? I can understand you now. What? That's well. I guess it's the same language the Dream King spoke in. So then, kid. We could use a mighty fine favour up from you. We need you to translate our ghost talk into music. I can do that. Hot dog. What's in the Sam Hill is going on? Are they meant to be Texan or something? John and Mary. If that's a reference, I'm not getting it. Is that you? Indeed it is. Uh, he said yes. Well, don't I feel like a right fool? Of course the spirits were our own king. Why would they care to hurt us? 
Guess that solves our ghost problem. In light of these events, you know, I'm making you the new mayor of Langtree. What? You heard right. Today I couldn't do my job and you could. My folks deserve a capable person to keep him safe. Simple as that. Or, uh, by the name is Mayor, but what are you talking about? You're an excellent leader. Remember the time Brinson's boy was lost in the woods? Aye, for the time Clyde got stuck in a tree. Hey, we're all proud to have you as mayor. The Bartlett is nice, but also kind of a dope. Most of our problems can't actually be so by singing. Hmm. After further consideration, I may have been a bit hasty about that mare thing. That's okay. I think I'm going on an adventure anyway. Well, we'll be right here, kiddo. Thanks for everything. Right. And at that juncture, I will be right back. I'm just going to quickly get a drink and blow my nose. Oh. Ow. So, just leave that going for a second.
actually timed that rather well because it was coming up to my cat's dinner. Talking to the spirit in the spirit language. You meet with the overseer. Yep. Yeah. I knew it! Okay, listen up. You're coming with me. Up on my broom. Whenever you're ready to go. Um, do I have a choice in the matter? Thanks, Burbit. <laughs> Time to talk. You want to chat? Do that with someone else. When you're ready to go, just jump on. Hold on to your butt. Uh. Why do I need to do that? Maybe I should be holding on to the broom. That seems like a far safer method. Performance at the Crazy Raven. This is it. What's this place? What do you think? It's my, me and my grandma's house. Come inside. I don't know why she's just got this. Hello, hello! So you talk to an overseer? It's so delightful! I don't know what this voice is. <laughs> We've been trying to commune with. It's like a. a it's almost Swedish. <laughs> with them, since we divined this world, world's feet. Uh, more like I've been trying to. You just sit at home and tell me what to do. I'm an old lady, Miriam. Old Schmold. I can see from your eyes. It didn't help you, did he? Nope. But the others might if I meet them. Oh. I thought you'd be more useful than that. Hmm, well, I like this one. So full of hope, unlike my granddaughter. Why is it always a grand grandmother and granddaughter? Why is it never a direct descendant? <laughs> I think you two want to travel together. Yeah, we'll just commit to it. She's going to have a sort of Scandinavian accent. Uh, excuse me? Miss Clown? I don't, we don't even know your name. Then, why don't you tell us your name then? Oh, What to call myself?
So apparently it's only four letters. There's no D, so it can't be Debbie. You know, you know what? Yeah, let's go with that. enough for some reason that's a very strange design choice what a wonderful what a wonderful name yeah yeah I can see that it's a pleasure to meet you. Is that good enough for you, Miriam? Uh, don't know why it took so many tries to just to spell your name. But sure, whatever. Welcome to the team, Billy. Don't mind my granddaughter. She's a fuddy duddy, but her heart is good. Let's get let's get going down this hill. Can't I fly with you? No, you're heavy. And anyways, we're going through a cave up ahead. There's an overseer access point in there. The Queen of Winds. And before you ask why we haven't checked this one out yet, it's because there's monsters in this cave. Monsters? Don't you freak out about it. I, I do love the, the very simple... I'm just... Very simple way of showing their expressions, but very effective. Oh, uh, when you say monsters, hey almighty, I'm a witch, I can handle monsters. Frankly, I don't know what we need you around for, but hey, Grandma, so Safi knows best. He's too trusting for her own good. I know she orchestrated this just to mess with me. She lives for that. Or hurry up already. Whee! close now why are you hovering why are you lowering your voice just shut up just 
Which is creepy. Shut it! You woke up this stupid monster. It's got terrible morning breath. Guess I have to take care of this mess. What's we going to do? I'm a witch with awesome magic powers. I'll use those. Won't that hurt it? Uh, probably. That's how it this works. Monster attacks. We rough it up a little. It gets us through. Let me handle it. Bye. This will be over in five seconds. I want to get close and try talking to it. I actually had a D&D &D character that was very much of that sort of mindset. You know what? Chill. Knock yourself out. Looks pretty hard. Sure you don't want me to take care of it? No, I can do it. I'll sing even harder this time. won't fix my boyfriend. So, is it time for me to dish out some magic? No. What did you say about a boyfriend? One of you humans can hurt him. Us? Well, not you, but definitely a human. They cursed my boyfriend with some magic spell. Things have gone too far. We can't let any more people like you through. Hey. It's not like we came here to attack you guys. I mean, I would have, but... I'm really sorry about what happened to your boyfriend. If it's a spell that's been cast on him, you think singing might help? What? Magic spell, which? Hello? Does this not sound more, like more my forte? Are you saying you would help us? Uh, I guess. Alright, humans. I'll let you in. Apparently I decided to make that weird Scandinavian Arnold Schwarzenegger. Up here, humans. So, can you break the spell? Probably not. What? Huh? This is the work of someone really powerful. Kind of scary, actually. Not even Grandma Safi could fix this. We're used to humans attacking us. Attacked us? But never like this. Hey. Maybe humans and monsters should stop attacking each other. Wow, oh, great idea, but this one's already cursed. So, what can do we do? I don't know. 
I was a fool to think humans could help. Sorry, this happened, Mr. Monster. Let's go. Get out of our home. To there. Just ahead is a town called Delphi. If anyone knows the Queen of Wind's song, that's where they are. I'm tired of waiting around for you, so I'll see you there. Welcome to Delphi. This town used to be great. But these people ain't seen something good in a long time. Their spirits are dying, you know. I want to fix that. I want to bring their spirits back. But I need a singer. Holy cannoli! That voice! It's exactly what I've been looking for. Your voice. It would be perfect in the band I'm putting together. Name's Manny. Pleasure to meet you, Ace. Thing is, right now you're the only per other person in my band. So, help me out. Find me a couple of the musicians. We'll put on a show the likes of which the town's never... Uh, Stumbling over my words then. We'll put on a show the likes of which the town has never seen before. Aha. Uh -huh. Thanks for the fun side quest there, buddy. And you don't have time to fill every little request in this dump. Focus on finding the Queen of Wind's song, Billy. I'm supposed to be acting raucous and rebellious. But this town sucks so bad. I just don't have the spirit to be a proper teen. Looks like the sort of sweet shop that would turn up in the giraffe, the Pelly and me. At the very least, a Willy Wonka oriented shop. Well, hey there, Skipper! Oh, there, are you some kind of a musician? Kids these days just love music. I've been looking for a way to reach him. Maybe you can help. Can you write a jingle for my candy shop? That's the spirit kind of spirit I'm talking about. Okay, I'll give you the go and you can sing it. Something short and sweet. Ha ha ha!
Hopefully the kids agree. Working on some lyrics for the jingle you made. Very creepy. Should have given it another go, but hey ho. Uh. Hey, being single. Why won't anyone date me? These two trusting looking people. Hey, you new in town! What's with the kid up? I bet you're really cool. Wanna do something thrilling? Um. No, you don't. You do not want to do something thrilling, Billy. <laughs> With being weird, Mitzi. That kind of looks like one of the Muppets. Kind of looks like if Grover got really old and depressed. Uh... What's the point? <laughs> What's the point? I don't even bother. Who uh, even cares? Uh, <clears throat> I was go I went for I was trying to go for Grover and end up ended up sort of halfway between that and John Major. Hey there, interested in buying some beans? And except out of beans right now but you can still pay me I'll deliver the next time I'm in town actually don't have any money either well I'll put you down for 500 <laughs> okay another Muppet looking character have you heard the new home sweet theme song? It has some nice qualities to it. But does it stand out in the crowded candy shop genre? Be kind of worried if that was an actual thing in reality. I think not. Uh hi. I don't really have time to talk to you. I'm a pretty cool guy here in Delphi. I don't know what this vo that voice was meant to be. Uh... No, make yourself comfortable. This is the coolest place to hang in Delphi. Food, drinks, music, crazy raven. Tell your friends. Okie dokie, take care. I know, business has been slow lately. Working on our marketing. I've been practicing a bit of a comedy routine. Want to hear one? What did the ox say to her kid when he moved out? Bye, son. Oh. Yeah, no one ever wants to hear my jokes. My buddy Manny is trying to put a band together to perform here. Short guy, mustache, red jacket, kinda slimy voice. I don't know if they, you know any mus musicians.
Arr. This is the evil cafe. Every day I come in here. Every day I serve coffee. Every day I wonder why. Hmm. I'm reading. I'm not fast enough for that. Not quite on my level, but pretty good. Very good, too. Oh, I thank you. I'm Viola, by th Really? That's the name you're going with, okay. I'm Viola, by the way. Pleasure to meet you. 
Wanna join a band? With you? Yep. And this guy called Manny. Oh, Manny, huh? He's been begging for me to join this band for a long time. But if he's t got you in there too, this might really be something this time, hmm? All right, I'll perform with you. But I'll talk to Manny about this arrangement. Um, it's a fiction story. It's hard to get into. Ah, uh, well, there's these four kids who decide to play a game. But the game brings about the end of the universe. They have to go on a sort of planetary quest. Collect materials and make a new universe. Aliens and time travel involved. It's a lot to get into. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of want to read that book. I've just been going all over the place with the voices I've been doing in this game. Also, hi, Billy. Uh, Hey, you should go to the Crazy Raven. It's only the coolest hangout spot in Delphi. I definitely don't want work there. This is candid viral marketing. Yeah, pretty much. I'm um, just... You know, doing what I can. Hi, my name's Nate. I have some backstory to tell you. So, eh, it's appreciated. I've realised I've actually messed up with um, sharing about stuff, but hey, uh, first the initial teething problems with doing streams and all that sort of thing. Uh, no, um, unfortunately, because of knowing the nature of the game, I, I've got to hear the backstory. Okay, here is some backstory. This town is over 400 years old. Well, thanks for listening. I've always got more backstory if you want to hear it. Well, uh, the... Uh, Okay. Hey, welcome to the Delphi Inn. Interested in a room? No. What else is new? See, uh, somehow I'm getting told these people's names without them even mentioning them. Oh, sorry. Was I playing too loud? No! 
Do you want to join a band? Uh, not really. Oh, I really think you should join my band. Let's talk. Okay, sure. That's why it turns out to be Weird Al. Oh, hello. So what's this about a band? <gasps> That's why you should totally join my band. Well, you just said blah a lot of times. <laughs> Like sometimes the humour in this game is questionable and other times it works. But I think I got the gist. Truth is, I don't think I can do it. Why can't you do it? I've never been on a stage before. And I always wanted to play my first show with my mum. Oh, well, where is she? Passed away. You're in Delphi for her funeral. Oh, that's fine. Just dig up the corpse and prop it up. Bit of formaldehyde painted on. It'll be fine. I just realised what I suggested by saying that, but apparently I'm in very. That's just, he's a wandering bard. That's <laughs> I'm sorry. My mum was the one who taught me to play. She was really famous, you know. Never thought I'd live up to her. But I at least thought one day I'd come back to play with her. I think you should just leave me alone right now. I don't want to talk anymore. So that's exhausted for now. Hey, little bard. Are you following me around? Yeah. No. I'm pretty busy, actually. But not too busy for you. Um. I just think of you as a weird spirit that follows me around. And let's keep the relationship at that. No offence. But, um... You kind of creep me the fuck out. Is he with what? None of your beeswax. So that accordion player. Gonna help them, right? I want to. Do you know what you're gonna do? No, you can talk to ghosties now, right? Oh yeah. You got this. <laughs> um I don't think so. Uh you never know. Now, I can't remember if I'm meant to go talk to the accordion player first, or...
I have some backstory to tell you. Okay, here is some backstory. The girl who works for the Crazy Raven wants to be a dancer. Well, thanks for listening. You're a weird individual. Okay, let's go to the cemetery. In a while since I did a proper jam session. Thanks. Well, the spirits in this game are surprisingly um, fine with you. I don't know why you called me. I need my kid Ash. Go talk to them. got to go be translator because no one else can speak spirit apparently you again. My uh, ghost bum is here. She's just speaking in strange symbols to me. Oh right. You can't talk windings. That's what it might as well be is windings. Guess not. I can help. You and your mum play music together. I can be the bridge between you. Huh? As in, with my accordion? Yes. She'll understand. Just play.
Ow. It really was her. She was there in the sound of her accordion. What did she say? A lot. Stuff that sounds cheesy put into words. I think you would want me to play with you. I guess in her memory, at least I can do. That's great! Yeah, I, like, I'm, I got drew in fr to this for, from two things. One, because it looks cute and everything like that, and I, I can't deny it's an odd game, but that was part of what drew me in, because it's very unique in the mechanics and everything like that, so I just thought, you know what, let's give this a go. I saw it being streamed on another... saw another person streaming it, and I was just sort of like, you know what, this looks fun, let's... let's see what it's all about. Because I was coming in right at the tail end of it. So. I have a few spoilers for how this game ends, but I just don't know how it progresses. Please don't make a big fuss about it. I'm nervous about this, but I'll do my best. Okay. I think we'll go for another sort of fifteen minutes or so and then we'll wrap up for today. I'm admittedly feeling quite hungry and I could do with I think I would start getting cranky if I went on for much longer Ace you did it these are some performers you found but what do you expect Delphi's got talent I may have neglected to mention this, but I'd already booked a show before I met you. <laughs> oh god, this voice is gonna kill me. It's at the Crazy Raven tonight. Actually, it's right now. We are late. So follow me. So, we all know the plan, yeah? Mm hmm Yes, so. Uh, I don't think I do. Oh, yeah. Well, don't worry about it. Worry, Ace. We got it all sorted out for you. Let's follow our lead. We're gonna do great. Nope. Don't sweat it too much. It's only our first show. Nobody knows us. It'll be a small crowd. Think of it like a warm-up. Yo, you folks ready to what? Ready or what? Yeah, yeah, sorry, we're late. The whole town is practically here. They're out there waiting, man. The, uh, the whole town, huh? Yeah, the whole town. You think they got anything better to do tonight? Hope you're worth the wait. Yes, sweet cards. As soon as you're ready, hit the stage is right through this door. I can't believe this is happening already. I don't feel ready at all. 
Maybe this was a mistake. I'm sure you'll do great. You know, my boy, he wasn't kidding. This town needs a real kick in the butt. And tonight's the night we give it to him. It's no surprise so many people came. You must be excited to see us. Every moment we delay, the tension rises. Let's not keep those poor people waiting much longer. Right. God, how long does this go on for? like us. Sounds like they want an encore. Well, anyone got anything? Mm -hmm. My time to shine. Wait, did someone just go out there?
An old, old song she used to play about the Queen of Winds. Almighty, I'm so nervous. Play beautifully, Ash. Thanks. Is that really the song of the Overseer? Um, yeah. Nice job on that show. You probably saved my idiot boss from having to close the raven. And that saved my job, so thanks. That show you put on was fire. I have a feeling business is gonna be better for a while now. It's gonna keep up the momentum with more acts. Okay, I think we are going to leave it there for now. Um, uh, I don't know if that one viewer is one remaining viewer or if that's just me, but if there is someone still there, then cool. If not, well... Goodbye, me. <laughs> uh, uh, next stream should be same time next week. Uh, whoever intent, if anyone intends to come on by, then catch then. You know what? On the off chance, let's let's go on a raid. Um. Remember how to do this. Um...
That's it. Close. Alright. Fine. Where did I put my phone? Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna have to... For some reason I'm not getting the SMS, so... I'm gonna have to sort that out. I'm uh, just going to end here. Uh. And, well... To anyone watching, I will hopefully see you next week. Bye-bye.